we're at uh, Beatty, Nevada right now. We're headed down to a location that has a bunch of uh, stolen property from a local museum. They're allegedly selling stolen property on eBay. Hopefully we can uh, make contact with them and get some of the stolen property back. Share. Search warrant, show me your hands! That guy's sure Sheriff's office. office! We got a warrant, come out! Come out, Sheriff. Sure. Show, show your hands. Show your hands. Come out, come What's out. What's going on, Red? Come out, come out, come out. Come out. Come show your hands. Come out. Come out. Okay, let me. Come out. I got two little kids right. in here. Right. Okay, hold on. What is this about? Why am I being arrested? The reason we're here is there, there's some stolen property that you have listed on eBay that was stolen from the, the local museum here. Do you? Really? Yeah, do you do you have that property inside? Not stolen property. Do you have the list of it? I need to know what we're talking about. Well, well, we have pictures of it. We're gonna grab it and show you. So this is stuff you listed for sale that's stolen from that local museum okay, here. Okay, some of that stuff was given yeah, to some me. Yeah, some of it, but the okay. highlight no, was with the, I'm, with the I'm, Okay, who was it given to you by? That salt shaker I got from Where's it at? It's in a uh, in the It's in the trailer, yeah. correct? I'll show you where it is. Okay. I didn't steal and anything. This... That's what I mean. I didn't know that any of this was stolen. You just have the stolen property yeah. off. He gave this okay. stuff to me. Uh, who's he? Where I moved in. I don't work I don't work here. I work in he Prouse, used, so I don't know. He used to live over, names over by Schultz. He was okay. a friend of mine, and when I got these kids, and I didn't really have much, and he, I loaned him some money, and he gave me a bunch of trinkets, oh, basically. Yeah, sure. And then when I decided to do eBay, I put them on there because I need money, not okay. because. And I live in this motorhome, home. I don't have room for all that stuff. All right. There's a bunch of charges we have so far. There's the trailer, there's the wreck, so they're going to be in there searching it probably for a while, digging stuff out. But this is a, uh, it's one of the items from the museum, so it's. To validate our warrant, you didn't think it was. I've had it for months. I mean, I didn't know that it was stolen. You didn't think. I mean, those. Are, I've never. This is some random stuff. This is a first for me that I'm, I've ever I'm done not, a search warrant for these type of items. And I've, ne I've had no clue. Would you? Like would you agree? Dishes. Would you agree with me though? This is some random stuff. That, yes, and I never had no idea. And this is a really small town. <laughs> it, it is. This is a small town. I didn't, didn't even you, live here when the. You wouldn't the, think it would be from that museum. museum was stolen that from. that museum I didn't burglary. Live here then. We're gonna take her down to the detention center. We gotta remove these kids from this environment, make sure that they're okay. Their aunt is gonna take custody of them. She's very cooperative with us and seems like a, a very good person. Um, the stolen teapot from before, stolen uh, a pepper shaker, stolen bottles. I guess these this chief bottle is very uh, unique, but I'm being told this is older, older bottles. These are all stolen from the museum. There's, uh, some uh, shoe shine stuff. It was a really big deal when their museum got burglarized, and that's why these these items they're unique. They're easy to find, and, and it was awesome that we located them. Because a lot of the times when you work stolen property cases, you you don't find the items. And here today, um, the the case officer did a great job doing the investigation and getting the warrant and getting this property back to the museum.